Save 10% with my code BOBBY10 on raw, organic, grass-fed and grass-finished freeze-dried organ meats from Grassland Nutrition. Link in the description box. Alright guys, welcome back to the channel. If you're new, my name is Bobby. Guys, today we're going to react to the mathematical miracles of the Quran by Red Mile. For me personally, reading the Quran was sufficient. The message of the oneness of God, Tawheed, was all I was looking for. I personally am not much of a mathematician. Nevertheless, this will be interesting to watch. However, just an extra bonus on top of the already very miraculous Quran. Let's have a look. Now, there are some mathematical miracles of the Quran. <sighs> Throughout all the Quran, if you count some specific words, you will come across to, a very, to very meaningful results. I would like to give you some examples. For instance, if you count the word punishment in the Holy Quran, There's throughout the whole Quran, it is repeated some 117 times. Yeah. Whereas the word forgive is repeated some 234 times inside the whole Quran. Mm. 234. If you multiply 117 by 2, you're going to have 234. It is very meaningful. Why? Because Quranic morality, Allah recommends, Allah orders believers, Allah orders Muslim, Muslims to forgive rather than punishing. It is very meaningful. True. Moreover, Allah orders to our Prophet, say, it is repeated some 332 times. And the response, they said, it is again equally repeated some 332 times. The words world and, and hereafter they are repeated 115 times equally. Devil and angel, those two words are equally repeated some 88 times. That's interesting because by mirroring world and the hereafter or devil and angel, you have this display of a duality, of course. You have the evil forces fighting the good forces. You have the material world and the metaphysical world equally displayed. Now, heaven and hell. Those two words are equal, equally Same. repeated 77 times. Zekah. Zekah is an Arabic word. Its translation is donation. The financial donation that a Muslim is supposed to give to poor. Mm -hmm. And it is repeated 32 times. And the barakah, the blessing that comes out of giving a donation to a poor, it is repeated 32 times. It is equally mm -hmm. repeated. It is very meaningful again. Now, summer, hot and winter cold. Those words are equally repeated five times. And richness and poverty, those two words, it is very interesting. Rich, richness is repeated 26 times, whereas the poverty is half of 26, which is 13. And woman and man, those are repeated equally 23 times. Well, do you know any idea what those numbers represent? Well, let me remind you, if you remember from the chromosome numbers of a human being from the previous slides. A human body contains 46 different chromosomes. That comes the half of this 46, which is 23, comes from the father. And the other uh, half, which is 23, comes from the mother. Whereas okay, you got the same like repetition it. number for You don't have to be a mathematician to appreciate this. That's woman good. and man, 23 and 23. If you add 23 to 23, you're going to have 46, which will give you the chromosome number of a human being. And of course, it displays the male and the female nature, that we have two pairs created by God, something that we have forgotten nowadays. Give you the chromosome number of a human being. Now, finally, I would like to give you the meaning of land and sea. Land is repeated 13 times, whereas the word sea repeated 32 times. Well, at first... You have more water than land. Sight doesn't seem to be very meaningful. No, However, if you do a simple math, you're going to have 13. If you add 32, you're going to have 45 as for the result. And the percentages, if you divide 13 to 45, you're going to have 28,88%. And 32 to 45, 
as for the word C, you're going to have 71,11%. Now, do you have any idea what those percentages represent? If I would have to take a guess, as I said already, this here, the 28% must be the land mass of Earth and the roughly 71% must be the water mass of the planet. Taking a guess here, let's see. Well, I'll tell you, those numbers will give you the, all the lands all over the I world won. on the Earth Yay. occupies 28,88% of the whole That's amazing. Earth. It is amazing. And all the seas, oceans, rivers, all the water occupies... 71,11% of the whole earth. Now again, these repetition numbers are very meaningful and it clearly represents us and gives us... Especially if you look into the context how this book has been produced over a thousand years ago in Arabia. How could they have known? Evidences that the Holy Quran is word of Allah. And it cannot be, definitely can't be a scripture of a man. This is not possible. All right, guys, and this is it for today's video. Just a very short one today. Nevertheless, it was educational. It was entertaining. As I said in the beginning, for me, all of those added miracles are not even necessary. I was very impressed by the Quran. However, still, this was interesting to see, especially the water and the land mass that was precisely displayed even down to the percentage. As always, please let me know in the comment section which video to react next to. If you like, this video leave it a thumbs up if you haven't subscribed already guys please do so and if you want to support this channel all the links are in the description box below thank you very much as always may god bless you all much love and peace